hammer game. Cause we always hit the nail on the head. Hey, hit that like button for me. And subscribe to the channel if you ain't already. And make sure you turn on that post no notification bell. So when I post videos, you'll get the alert or whatever. It is what it is. Anyway, hammer game. Cause we always hit the nail on the head. So, as you guys already know, 2019 wasn't the greatest year. We ended the year six and seven. I'm not gonna go over that. You know, most of us Miami fans know what it is and it is what it is. So, Phil Steele has released his preseason rankings. And to my surprise, Miami is ranked at number 12 on this list. Now, he also did rank Miami as the number one, the number one improved team since 2019 season with Miami adding Derek King and Rochi you know those are two of the prospects that we added not only that but the 2020 class was solid plus the commits that we're getting now from the 2001 class they have Miami ranked as number 12 on the preseason list now other preseason lists are starting to come out I seen another one recently. I did a video on, uh, well, I did a live on that one. We discussed it. Uh, Miami was um, ranked number 17 on that one. Now, also on, on Phil's list, if you're wondering about Florida State, they did not make the top 40. So, the improvement that we're seeing down here in Miami, they're not getting the same results up there in Florida State. So, as you guys already know, Miami has beaten Florida State for the last three years. The games have not been blowouts. Well, 27-10 last year. The other ones was more closer than that, but they're predicting that Miami will be favored in 11 of these games. 11 of these games. If we have a regular season. Now, if you already know, Michigan State is no longer on our schedule. So if the schedules were to stay the same without Michigan State, because you know they're going conference only, then we would need um, to pick up another team Possibly Notre Dame, but that's that's neither here nor there because right now we we do not know the situation of we will we have a um, season, will it be conference only, or you know, whatever. It's on a daily basis that we find out things are weekly or maybe next month we'll find out something different. But anyways, Miami's ranked number 12 on this guy's list. Now, he's contributing this to the improvements made to the team. Like bringing in Reed Lashley, you know, Telly Lockett out of um, Florida State. He's a Miami guy. He's been in the Miami area. He's coaching in the Miami area. And he's contributing a lot because um, if you guys don't already know, I'm guessing the motto for this season, the 2021 upcoming season, not, not the 2020, but the 2021 upcoming season, the motto is make Miami great again. Put on for your city. Stay home and put on for your city. So, number 12, we're moving up. I mean, if you ask me last season, would we even be ranked in anybody's preseason? I would say no. Six and seven was a hard pill to swallow, but we're on the rise. Manny Diaz and the coaching staff, everybody that's putting in work at the University of Miami is doing a great job this off season. <laughs> I don't know what else to tell you, man, but I'm glad to see that you know, we're starting to get a little respect around the country. Bringing in top recruits. As you know, um, a couple days ago, we did land five, our first five-star of the 2021 season. And, well, 2021 class. And that would be James Williams. Hopefully, there's more to follow. Hopefully, we lock down the Palmetto Five. And I'm, I think that's pretty much it. Um, you know, have a good day, guys. Go Kane. Hey, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'm out.